The Locust is an inner sphere 20 ton light mech built specifically for reconnaissance and trolling assaults. The chassis is one of the most common in battle at Eclar because it is cheap and made in current sweatshops across the galaxy. Having a maximum speed exceeding 129 km per hour, it can outrun most enemies and baits idiot players into turning around to chase them instead of focusing on the front lines. Pro players can Leroy Jenkins entire lances of enemy battle meshes and make them waste precious time and ammo. That's time wasted trying to shoot you and ammunition that is not being shot at your dumbass teammates. Reconnaissance usually involves getting to higher places to scout the battlefield inaccessible to heavier meshes using jump jets. But the Locust says fuck that and runs around the map like the Looney Tunes Roadrunner on steroids instead. Use distance and stealth to spot for your team while placing consumables such as UAVs, airstrikes and artillery to support your team without being seen. With plenty of speed and maneuverability, good lock cut pilots don't need its scrap armor anyway. You use its low profile and magical bullet dodging legs to not get your ass shot. If you get your legs blown off, you are as useful as a Weight Watchers program is to Rosie O'Donnell. Keep moving. Duck and dodge shots from ballistics like the cheap, spastic, crazy person that you are with a zigzag pattern. As its name implies, locusts are deadly in swarms and feast upon their prey with small lasers. Punish your foes for not having good torso twisting range. When alone, you are an easy kill. Do not engage with other mechs by yourself. This applies to light mechs as well. Your armor is glass and your machine guns will sound like the pitter patter of raindrops. Soloing a kill is hard mode and takes experience of hit and run skills before new players even get a kill. It is not recommended that new players purchase one as you will either be dying or eating glue in the corner. If you do happen to steal a kill, rub the salt on the wound of defeat. For increased irony, use the Kodiak core horns on your low cut. Question, do you like submarines with lasers? If you answer in the affirmative, consider maps with deep water, which allows the mech to be nearly or completely submerged in water. Water reduces damage for shots passing through. Even lasers. Just like in real life. This covers the basics of the 20 tons of terror. Now go out there and touch their anus with your knowledge of the metallic blur of doom. This is hilarious. indeed there you go